diseases and its prevalence is increasing year by year, especially diabetes type 2. World Health Organization estimates that diabetes mellitus was the seventh leading cause of death in 2016. According to Departemen Kesehatan, in 2013, diabetes mellitus in Indonesia is reaching 12 billion people. However, conventional insulin therapy and combination drugs are unable to provide good metabolic control of glucose. Indonesia is famous for its natural resources. One of the plants that has anti-diabetic activity is turmeric. Turmeric has active ingredient which has various mechanisms such as decreasing TNF-alpha, lowering FFA level in plasma, increasing insulin level, and many more. Obtaining curcumin from turmeric is not efficient because it is so many turmeric to produce a little amount of curcumin. Biotechnology approach in the form of innovative fungi as the answer. The active ingredient is called curcumin. Unfortunately, curcumin has several weaknesses as oral formulation. So, to solve this problem, the suitable formulation is the implant with an analog system. Based on the background, we propose a paper entitled Glucose Sensitive Multilayer Film Implant from Endophytic Fungi Curcumin as Diabetes Mellitus Alternative Medication. The methods are as follows. Isolation of curcumin from turmeric endophytic fungi consists of isolation endophytic fungi from turmeric rhizomes, extraction from fermented fungi, and isolation of curcumin. Fabrication of glucose sensitive multilayer film implant consists of synthesis of 21 ohm star PDMA EMA and preparation of curcumin loaded LBL multilayer films. Glucose oxidase will convert glucose into gluconic acid, causing pH declining in implant. It will induce star PDMA EMA to rearrange the film morphology, resulting in an open status of the film to release curcumin. The implant will stop releasing curcumin when the pH is gone back to normal.